What's up, YouTube? This is Bait here, back again with my Phoenix Ride Let's Play. And last time, last time, the last episode was like a history lesson of the past of Edgeward and Larry and Phoenix here. And we learned a bunch of things well, which led to the career choices of these two young gentlemen right here. Anyways, we talked to Edgeward here. And uh, not really sure what we're going to do next. To be there's a DL6 photo. Hmm. What if I would? Let's see if he's gonna say something. I'm just gonna give him like traumas, but uh, you know. Let's see. <gasps> no! Don't show him that. You're right. Okay. Yeah. What is it? Um, nothing. Okay. Let's. DL6 case file? I don't know. I think I'm just gonna move somewhere. So I kinda think that we're done with this, although I, I I really don't know. Let's go see Grossberg if there's like anything going on here. Is he still he's out again? He's always partying somewhere else where stuff happens. Important stuff. Okay, let's do, do 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 Let's go to the um criminal affairs. Well, nothing here. Gumshoe music just playing in the background, so nothing special. Well, let's go to the Gord Lake. Why not? We haven't been here like after the trial, which just happened. So uh, let's go see this place again. Oh! Gumshoe is here! Oh, cool. Hey Pearl, long time no see. Indeed, it has must have been a few days again. Since I recorded any stuff, but yeah. What's up? So, Detective Gumshoe. And you weren't even in the court. Last time. Mm, I don't know. Gonna stop rambling. Okay, close one today, eh? Oh, yes. It's so worked up, I snapped my tie in half. Whoa! Oh, sorry, sorry about that. No problem, though. No. Next year we know, we now know who really did it. You mean the boat shop caretaker? Yeah. Look, I'll make you a promise. I'll have the scrundle in my custody by file time to tomorrow. Come what may. Yes. Okay. It's my duty to you as a police officer. Now I'm off to catch a criminal. Cool. <gasps> Gumshoe is sure active today. Oh, one more thing. Cool. Nick! No one can go into the woods today. Oh, really? The woods where Lotsa was camping? Uh, and why is that? The woods are off limits to the camping, and apparently, the park ranger found out. You got pretty mad. Uh, no one go. Oh, no one can go there in a while. Okay. I guess Lotta's in a lot of trouble. Ha ha ha! Didn't I use that uh, as a title of one episode like a while ago, I think? Episode 50 something or 49 or I don't know. Somewhere in those lines, I think. Somebody correct me if I was wrong. But I think I did. Ha <laughs> ha. It's funny. Anyways, anyway, I'll be seeing you tomorrow. Sweet. Okay. Well, let's go to the woods. <laughs> um, to the beach first. But apparently it's off limits, so most likely it won't even be in the options. Huh? The steel eyesore is missing. Eyesore? Looks like the hot dog stand is close too. No, I guess Larry's been too busy with the trial to show up for work. Yes. That rigor figures. Well, we're gonna go to the boat rental shop. Dud, 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 dud. The old caretaker got away. The one that got away. Isn't that a song by Alice Cooper? From one of his new... New... LPs, I think. I might be just rambling. 
Along came a spider, yes. Yes, why am I rambling about random stuff? I do not know. I never imagined he might be the real murderer. <coughs> I do know that clearing of throat. Yes, uh, it must be the mm, Grossberg dude. <laughs> what is he doing here? Uh, yes. May I ask you the same question? Out for a walk? Hmm? Oh, the days of my youth. Like the scent of fresh lemon, you see. Uh, Mr. Grossberg, there's no time for idle reminiscing. Is your actress dry lens tomorrow? Oh, that's true, yes. But from what I saw of today's trial, Mr. Edward should be fine, right? Mm, well, I'm not so sure about that. Ho oh, ho, what do you mean by that? Well, I'm not sure. Hmm. If you find anything out, uh, come by my office at once. I may be able to offer some assistance. Ooh. Thanks. Bye. Bye. Says Mr. Popo. Hmm. Anyways, uh, rambling. Uh, what do you think, Mr. Grossberg was doing here anyway? Who knows? Indeed. Can we go to the house? Caretaker's shack. I wonder if the parrot, the parrot is here. Sweet. Hmm. Nobody's home. Polly is. Hello, hello, Squawk! Hey, it's Polly! I wonder where you... Where your owner is gone, Polly. Hello, hello, Squawk! I can't believe he'd run off and leave his poor parrot to fend for herself. Hello, hello, Squawk. Hmm... Intense music. Let's examine the parrot. Yeah, probably you shouldn't. You shouldn't just ki kidnap her. Yes, the police know about her anyway. I'm sure they'll do something. Yes. Well, okay. Sorry, Polly. He says I can't take you. Great. Now the birds are going to hate me. <laughs> well, is there like anything that we could do? Hmm. Kitchen, yeah. It's your job, woman. Blah blah blah, pasta. What is this hanging on the wall? Nothing? Okay. Can't even examine. Mm, fishing pole, blah blah blah. Think we already went through this, so. Yeah, better not. Well. And boat rental shop, let's go back. There's really nothing there. Durr. And indeed we cannot go to the woods. Why did I go here? I was just... I don't even know. Well, now we're gonna go to the beach. Nothing here. I guess we could, could go uh, talk to Mr. Grossberg. Although, I don't really know if we have anything that we could talk to him about, but we'll see. Uh, criminal affairs, and then... No, wait, where is the Grossberg offices? Here it is, okay. Okay. Uh, but he's not here. Okay. So apparently we have to do something. He he told that he would be here. I I thought we could just, you know, talk to him about something and then you know do stuff. Maybe present already something to him. What about Larry here? I think we're done with him. But Edgeward I think we still could talk to him about something apparently. Let's try to present something to him. What about the parrot? Does he have anything to say about that? Yep. Yeah. Uh, DL6. Hmm. 
Okay, let, oh, of course. Was the case that changed my life. And tomorrow on December 28th, its statute of limitations runs out. Tomorrow. Could that be a coincidence? But even if the case is finally closed on paper, it will never be erased from my memory. Never. Poor Mitch, Mr. Edgeworth. Can we talk to him now about DL6 stuff? Nope. Well, can we present something else? What if we present... I think we already presented this. I really have no idea. A turn is batch, that always helps. Nope. No, let's present this photo. Nope. What about gun? Nothing. This is nothing. I don't even know why we presented the metal detector thingy. What you might call it. Photo. Yes. Um, for no reason. You know, I was impressed by your deduction in the trial today. Granted, you <laughs> were at the end of your rope, but, but still. He noticed. Haha. <laughs> But we still can't talk to him about anything new. So we have to find some other stuff. Stuff it is stuff. Let's go to the law offices. But yeah, Larry. Uh, it's only Larry here. What about Grossberg now? Still nothing. Well, let's go to. Criminal Affairs... Mm. I'm kinda thinking there's something at the Gord Lake that we need to investigate. Hmm... Beach... Just going in circles again. <sighs> we weren't able to find anything from here, which is like... What can we do? We already examined this place, examined the parrots. This is just going to, yeah. Same thing. Hmm. Yes. And be back. Huh? What's wrong? Oh, never mind. Tell me. Just. Oh, you saw the TV, you remembered? There's your... Right. Right. Yeah, that's why I'm... Yes, I see. Huh. Well... I'm clueless. I have no idea what to do right now. The beach... Let's examine the trash can. With no trash. And we can't, can't go to the woods indeed. So, yeah. Kind of still thinking that. Let's just get out of here. Again, moving in circles. Gord Lake entrance. Let's go there. And then... Criminal Affairs... Hmm... Let's go to Detention Center. Can I present something still? I think I presented everything that I have here. And we can present this, cause... yeah. Well, should I present something to Larry here? Would he have anything to say about, you know, this? Yes, yes, blah blah blah. Might as well. I have no idea at this point what we should be doing. So we always we have to do some random stuff before we can make the case move forward. 
I don't think. Murder weapon. So seriously, there aren't people anywhere. We can't do anything at the shack. Oh, uh, shenanigans. Seriously, there must be something with Edgeward, because, you know, I bet there could be more options to talk about, but, uh, you know, I can't present anything. Sorry, nothing. Photo. And I shouldn't do that. DL6, we already went through it. He says nothing about this parrot. DL6, case file. Well, let's check it out. Elevator, this record. Do -do -do. No clues found on the scene. Gregory Edgeward, victim data. Mm hmm, with his son, he was nine. One bullet found in heart. Murder weapon was fired twice. Suspect data, Yanni Yogi, 37. Court bailiff trapped with uh, the Edgewards and memory loss due to oxygen deprivation after his arrest. Fiance Polly Jenkins committed suicide. Hmm. Is that a coincidence that the parrot is named Polly too? That is interesting. That is interesting and something that we could possibly keep in mind, but you know, Edgeward isn't saying anything. Mm, nothing, nothing, nothing. Autopsy report. We can't present anything to him to make him talk about new stuff, and there is nothing available. So, what do we need to do? Grossberg. There's still nothing here. Can I examine this place? Like, at all? Table for client, blah blah blah, nobody cares. I think I'm probably gonna call this for the day. And the next time when we come back, we're gonna definitely find some answers, cause, yeah. Shenanigans, I have no idea why can I, what should I do right now. So, uh, next time hopefully I will be, my deduc deduction ki skills will be the, on the top notch. So, um, uh, when we come back, indeed, I will find more information. What we should do, and, uh, then we can hopefully make Edward talk, and then possibly talk to Grossberg. And then possibly next time, hopefully, we can go back to the court. So that will be next time. So until then, this is the Flaming Spade, signing out. Peace.